What's up guys? I know there's been a bit of a drought from me uploading Sonic Frontiers related videos, even though I said that I would be covering that game up until it comes out. And I just want to say I am still planning on covering that game as well as Sonic Origins. It's just the fact that Sega is really not giving us anything to work with here. It's... The last thing they uploaded for that game was two months ago. Two months ago. And that was literally at the Game Awards. As, like, as great as the Game Awards were in terms of Sonic news, I can't really say I was... I can't really say... What am I trying to say here? As, as great as the Game Awards were... They, you know, two months is kind of a long wait for more news. And I get it, you know, the movie is the main focus right now. And I am really hyped to see the movie. I'm probably going to see it, like, day one, you know? Uh, I don't know if it's only going to be in theaters. If it's on, like, Netflix or something. Or if I can, like, go to a Redbox and buy it. Because... I'm not going to a movie theater. It's not safe right now because of the, um, <clears throat> a certain <clears throat> disease that we shall not talk about. Um, because I'm not trying to get my video taken down. Um, but yeah, I, I'm excited for the movie, but the fact that they're focusing more on the movie than they are on Frontiers is kind of worrying me. Especially since I heard Sonic Origins is supposed to come out literally in April with Sonic Movie 2. And we haven't heard anything about that game. So I'm definitely worried about that. I mean, remember, like, you know, when the first Sonic movie dropped? Like, they dropped uh, Sega, um, Sega Ages Sonic the Hedgehog 2. And it was it was pretty good, you know? But... They're kind of doing the same thing here, but literally they, they revealed Sonic Origins literally when they teased Sonic Frontiers. So that was like nine months ago, I think. So, yeah, I know I've, I'm kind of going on a rant here. The point is, I haven't really made Sonic Frontiers news because Sega, I mean, I haven't really made Sonic Frontiers news videos because Sega won't grow a pair and show us anything. And on top of that, you know, like, I know there's leaks, like, it, don't get me wrong, I'm aware of the leaks, but I would rather not cover those just because they're not official news, you know? And how am I supposed to know which leaks are real and which ones are fake, you know? Like, obviously some of the leaks did turn out to be true, but I, I'm not about to make assumptions for every week that comes out just because a few of them were true, you know? Um, with that being said, I, I hope you guys understand, like, I know the last thing I uploaded in terms of Sonic Frontiers was, um, I think it was my re initial reaction to the review. No, 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 no. It was my, re it was my reaction, and then the last thing I uploaded for Sonic Frontiers before this was that analysis video I made of the reveal trailer. But outside of that, I haven't made any Sonic Frontiers videos. I've been radio silent about that game the same way Sega has been radio silent about it. And honestly, can you blame me? I mean, I would talk about it more if Sega was giving us stuff to talk about. And that's the main thing I want to say with this video. That's the main thing I want to drive home is... I would talk about Sonic Frontiers, but Sega's just not giving us a whole lot to talk about. And, <clears throat> not gonna lie, the fact that they're not showing gameplay after, like, nine or ten months, <clears throat> that's definitely scaring me, because the game is literally supposed to come out at the end of this year. So, in eleven months. That might not sound like a long time, but guess what? We're already two months into 2021. Oh, actually, it could be 10 months because, you know, November, that is also in the holiday season. And, you know, Forces came out in November, if I'm not mistaken. So, 
Yeah, that, that's another red flag. They won't even show us. I mean, they won't even tell us when the game is going to come out. Um, I'll make another, like, video about this game where I kind of talk about some things that I'm excited for with Sonic Frontiers, but then some things that kind of scare me with that game. Because there's a lot I want to talk about in terms of that. But that that is going to be the main thing I want to say here is just... If Sega would show more stuff, I would be able to talk about this game more. And the main reason why I want to cover Sonic Frontiers is because I know when I covered Sonic Colors Ultimate on the, you know, in the months leading up to that, that game's release, I know that definitely made my channel go viral for a little while, especially when I made that video about Metal Sonic's animations in that game. Uh, that actually got a lot of people talking. But, you know, I, I just want Frontiers to kind of do the same thing. It's not all about the views, but I know, like, more people will watch. Like, I Okay, what I'm trying to say here is, I know people want Frontiers coverage. That's, like, the big thing right now. Same thing with Sonic the Hedgehog 2. You know, if I covered that movie, then I'll probably get a lot more reviews off of it, because that's just what's relevant right now, you know? Um, but I'll talk more about that some other time. I just wanted, I just wanted to say that for right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, all that stuff, cheesy YouTuber outro, and make sure you comment down below kind of what your stance on Sonic Frontiers and even Sonic Origins is right now. And even like Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and Sonic Prime, because they also revealed that back in, um, back whenever they did Sonic, um, Sonic Central, and they haven't shown anything for that either, even though I'm not as concerned about it, because, you know, Sonic has been pretty consistent with the animations, I can't really think of any, like, bad Sonic animations, you know? Uh, but yeah, it's your boy signing off. Peace. Take care, everyone.